Uh, Ingen says, says, uh, says, one of the keys on my keyboard doesn't work in lowercase in Microsoft Word. Uppercase works fine. WTF. Yes, truly. Other programs, it works fine also. No one seems to have heard of this problem. Any thoughts? Yes, I do. I've had very similar. And if it's if it's only kind of in Word effectively and it's nowhere else, the one thing I will say, one, have you tried other words where that particular, whatever the letter is that keeps changing, what's the word that it's actually changing in? Is it like capital I, you know, every time you type, you know, I am kind of thing, capital I reduces to a lowercase I or uppercase I, for example, yeah. but it's fine if it's inside a word. And so if it's something that seems to be somewhat unique as a character, more often than not, what I've actually seen is if you go into your spell, um, your, your spelling, spell check. often an autocorrect. Yeah. Yeah, it's a spell check autocorrect. So if you go to file options and in file options, you've then got your proofing. And underneath your proofing, if you go in there and have a look at your autocorrect options, you might actually find in the autocorrect list. So if you work your way down the list, there's usually a really long list of different things. And it's really handy to actually have because you can actually, um, for example, inside a business, you could be literally going WTF and have it spell it out in full. Hopefully we're not swearing. But do you know what I mean? Um, you can, every time you do a spelling mistake, it can then auto-correct for you. I do it all the time, especially on my phone. I always go T-B-E. Oh, no, it's just the B and N are just all too close together. So I fixed it so it auto-corrects and fixes it and puts it correct for me. So usually I, that's where I see it often happens. It's in the auto-correct. Have a look through there and see if that will actually fix it. That's kind of the one solve. Because if it's only happening there and it's only happening on sort of that, then I would say it's autocorrect. You know, I think you've discounted one other possibility here is that mm -hmm. you have nanobot infected jam that you have spilled on your keyboard <laughs> and it is intelligently <laughs> selecting and styming your effort to do that one uh, letter on your keyboard. That could happen. So it could be possible. It could. Absolutely. You don't know. We don't know. <laughs> <laughs> or like me, I accidentally chose the um, uh, the wrong keyboard, you know, on setup. So now every time I try and ah. do an at signal, it's, you know, I've got to swap it over and uh, I had to fix that, you know. But I don't apart know. from that, no. It's nano jelly. Order. I think it's nano jam. <laughs> nano. Yeah. Yeah. Ingen, good luck with the nano jam problem <laughs> yep. good luck you know eat it in the kitchen not around your keyboard that's all i'm saying and keep kids away